You ready? Yes, One, we two, can. three. Uh, today is uh, Friday, August 11th. We're doing a video for uh, Given a, a, a marriage agency here. I'm doing a testimonial. I happen to be a client uh, of Maya who owns the agency at Given a in um, Grodno, Belarus. And so I wanted to share with you my personal experience and why I strongly recommend uh, that you look into this agency uh, for many reasons. One, I've been traveling for the last two and a half months and my main purpose was to find a lifetime partner. I wanted to find a lady that I could spend the rest of my life with. Um, so I like this part of the world because the women are very beautiful, they're very educated, uh, they're very intelligent and they are marriage plan, which is very important. So anyway, so I'm over here and give me my agency. Uh, I want to tell you I'm not being paid to do this. I am, I'm doing it because I believe in Maya. She's very caring and she spends the time with you uh, and you meet uh, the ladies. Uh, she has over 600 ladies in her database. Um, and uh, when you decide who you want to meet, they decide if they want to meet you. So perhaps you make a list of say, you know, 10 girls that you would like to meet and, and have some coffee, water or whatever and meet here. Maya does spend some time with you. Sometimes she translates. Um, but the thing that I found about this agency is that the women are very genuine. They're very sincere. They're very honest. Uh, I dated uh, one of the several women here, I believe it was about eight women. Um, I had three that I had to make a big decision on, and I finally decided on, on, on one lady. And so we are engaged, and so we're going to Spain next week, so it's happening for me. So I'm here to tell you how it really is, I'm here to tell you the truth. And so all of you men who are out there in your couch, feeling a little depressed and you need somebody in your life, you need to, you need to come here. Uh, you, you cannot download a wife on the internet. You, <laughs> you, have to, uh, you have to really come and meet and feel and touch and converse uh, because you cannot really do this thing online. You know what I mean? So you have to come here. Now, I want to tell you about this agency and that is that all the ladies, like this lady right here, she filled out her profile personally, handwritten, and she signed it, and then she also brings a passport. And I'm pretty sure that Maya looks at the passport to find out if she's single, divorced, or married. Of course, if she's married, she wouldn't be accepted to the agency. And, and, of, and of course, they do have a, a meeting to figure out if this person is really valid, if this person's really interested in, in, in marriage, because after all, this agency is, uh, their main focus is really foreign men. They're pretty much from Europe or from America, Australia. And uh, Maya has done uh, well over 600 marriages. Uh, it's just amazing. And she's very experienced in doing this. This is a comfortable setting. From here, you meet, um, you meet the lady that you like. You can take her out to some fabulous restaurants, not too far of a walking distance from here. Uh, here in Grodno, there's the old town, which is very beautiful. It has museum, castle, by the river, it's very romantic. So it doesn't really matter your age because, for example, here you have a couple uh, that are pretty much in their, I would say, in their late 60s, probably, you know, mid 60s or something like that. And then you also have young couples, um, as you can see here. You know, but the main thing that I want to tell you is that here's a little baby that came from this couple. You know what I mean? So it's a lot of marriages that Maya is doing. On, a, you know, this is a small agency, and uh, she really puts her heart and soul into this business, uh, and she's excited about bringing people together, making unions, and so it's really working for her. So some of the things that I see here that she has in her agency is she has a map. Uh, pretty much a map of Europe or a map of different countries and what she does is she talks about um, where people are from and, and they pinpoint the different places they've been to, they've traveled and, and all of those things. So again, 
Um, I strongly recommend it. I used her service. Uh, I'm very pleased and very happy. Um, I wish I could replicate myself and instead of being one out girl, one man, I could be ten men because I would love to marry all this woman, <laughs> but you can't do it. So anyway, so I strongly recommend my, my hats off to uh, Give Me, and this is where the website is. Okay, and Maya speaks English, she's pretty fluent in English, and you can give her a call. Uh, and I'm sure she will put the phone number below somewhere. And you can speak to her on a personal basis. She's been doing this for 20 years. This is, again, a small agency. They also have a, uh, a professional English translator, an Italian one, and a French one. So it's a small office, but it's very congenial, very interesting. And I can't emphasize enough, the women here in Belarus are absolutely beautiful. They're very feminine, they're very sensitive, they're very intelligent, very educated. Uh, they're natural, you know, they don't have all those bad habits that uh, is the reason why sometimes we leave our countries to come to other places where women are more traditional. So anyway, so that's it for today. Uh, I wish uh, give me good luck and Maya and give her a call. Come over here. This is the website and I wish you a lot of luck, but you have to take action. You have to get off your seat. And I realize that you may be depressed, you have nobody that loves you and all that stuff, but you need to say to yourself, I have a purpose in life, I want to find somebody to be in love with, I want somebody that takes care of me, I take care of them. You know, being in love is, the, is a wonderful thing. So, get off your butt, buy a plane ticket, come down here, pick 10 girls from the website, and call Maya, email her, and things will happen. I did. If I can do it, you can do it. And by the way, I'm 60 years old and I found a woman that's in her mid-40s. And so, yes, there's a little bit of an age difference again. But, you know, I look a little younger, I'm a little active and so forth. So, I wish you lots of luck and success.